Hey, so I asked y'all, what's up with FN and why people don't have FN products? And so y'all gave me a bunch of answers and we're going to talk about it. Let's get it. So what you guys are about to watch is um, me on my Instagram, my FFL and rifle company page rustic arms follow us um we asked people why they don't really rock with fn firearms why more people don't have them and <laughs> the answers was hilarious to say the least so sit back relax and i haven't them. even looked at all the answers yet but i'm pretty sure this is why most people don't have fns but like you get what you pay for like fn don't get me wrong, with the new flat face trigger, not just any FN. But FN is is totally worth it. With the new flat face trigger. Yeah, I feel you on top of that because that trigger is as heavy as Gorilla Elbows. Like, it don't make no sense how heavy that trigger is. But the new FN flat face trigger, and they're putting it in all their guns. They putting it in all their guns. So like, listen, that new FN flat face trigger is it, that you, it might be the way. It might be the way. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. They putting it in all the guns. And then cost, I get it. FN is pricey. All the military contracts, they feel like they can charge what they want. But... Has anybody ever shot an FN and felt like it wasn't worth the money? All right, I'm going to challenge this one. For anybody who say you can get better for the price, what would you get? Right? So let's just say um, the FN, the new tactical bundle, right? Let's just say it's nine, I don't know, 979, right? Let's just say you find a tactical bundle with five 24 round mags and one standard capacity mag of 15 for five for 979. What are you getting that's better than the FN for five seven or for 979? That's what I want to know. Cause that's a lot. Like to say you can get better for the price, I don't know. Now, to get more for the price, I get it. Because you can get a Glock, put a red dot on it, and probably even a light. But better? Mm, yeah, that's. this is how I know. I got to... If y'all go watch my stuff or even go look at the videos I posted, FN is redoing all their triggers. The new FN flat face trigger, which to me, honestly, is nothing but a clone of the Apex trigger. But nonetheless... They got their own flat face trigger and it's amazing, y'all. Like it's it's dope. The reset is fire. It's smooth. Like it's got a, a clearly defined wall, a crisp break. All them action phrases that YouTube reviewers be using is got it. Y'all gotta get to your local gun store, or if your local gun store don't got it, you just got you need Rostic Arms to do a review on it. I got y'all, man. I got y'all. I, I, I can do that. Smart Shooters LLC, tap in. We gonna do a review. Yeah, I'm about to see this answer all night. I'm already knowing. Money. Yep. Now, this is true. When I got my very first FN, there was zero aftermarket support for FN. There was no... The FN was made for FN stuff. And if you didn't buy that, you got nothing. So, yep, I completely understand that. They definitely got smart and realized, start bringing them, uh, start making sure their guns come with plates and all of that. Make sure they do it the right way. Hey, and this meets my criteria too. If you don't have a FN, you should have a Glock. I'm just saying. I may or may not think Glock is the best gun ever made. I'm not a fanboy. It's just true. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Boy, this going to be the answer more than anything. Price, baby. But I get, but I'm telling y'all, watch, I'm going to repost some pictures and videos. The quality is there. It's worth 
it justifies the price to me, but not as like a carry gun, no. Because if I my gun ever got to get taken at evidence and it's a FN, I'm going to be pissed. Yeah, and I can't, I, one thing I can attest to is FN is no more reliable than MMPs or Glocks. Like they all are just as reliable, right? Like I done shot tens of thousands of rounds through Glocks. I would say I put at least a couple thousand rounds through some MMPs between the nine mil and the 10 mil. Um, and everything I've seen has been just as reliable as any FN I ever ran. This what I love to hear, a brother of quality. Yeah, I'm loving that. Yeah, story of FN's life, that price tag. But they proud of their products, though. If I had as many military contracts as them, I, I probably would charge a lot, too. I Yeah, I probably would. Because they getting away with it. People keep paying for it. Yeah, you won't hear nothing bad about reliability. What you'll hear most people just say is they just can't afford it. Or not even that they can't afford it, that they just think their money could go a lot further um, with something different. Man. And it's not cello saying this, y'all. So I don't want y'all to think. Because a, a lot of my gun homies, they own FNs, man. And they swear by them. And I understand why. You know what I mean? Like, the quality is just unmatched. Like, even building some out this week and putting, you know, Trigicons and the right lights on them. And just, man, they, they definitely set up right. They set up right, man. Like. FN do right by their customers. I would encourage everybody, you know, step your hustle up, whatever you got to do, get you a FN, man, because especially the new one, that tactical bundle I've been, man, I've been selling them like crazy. Four 24 round mags plus a standard flush mag. Like, man, listen, optics ready, threaded barrel. It's it's the one stop shop. That's what everybody gonna say. But in my humble opinion, I think it's absolutely worth it. I think it's worth it to tap in, see what F go to your range and rent one, man. I promise you, I would trade easily trade two, three Smith and Wessons or SIGs or whatever to get me a good FN. Now, it just the when it comes to SIGs, let me make it clear. Not the M17, not the X5 Legion, but all the other ones. <laughs> yeah, man. I, I'm going to just tell y'all, man, it's, it's y'all, y'all got to try it. Y'all got to try it. Y'all got to give it a chance, man. I know it's expensive, but I highly think it's worth the money. Highly, highly. I'm thinking about buying one just to rent out to my students in my CPL classes because it's worth it, man. Well, that's all the responses that I'm going to share for now. You guys let me know down in the comments, why do you think more people do not have FN products? And if it's price, just go ahead and drop the money sign in the comments. That'll let everybody who watched to the end know that you agree and we agree that their products just cost too much. I think they're worth it. If you don't, let me know why in the comments.